Hey guys, what's up everyone? Welcome back to Wee Fishing Resort. Here we are. Yes. We're at the uh, Team in Paradise Beach. Yeah. I think it's time to go ahead and leave uh -huh. this area. And look. <laughs> baby Rosalia, Baby Daisy have joined the YouTube channel. Hi, Baby Rosalina, Baby Daisy. Let's see, make sure we're not missing anything. Don't look like we are. Do we want to register for this one? Or no? Um, not for the video? Not for the video. Okay, we'll we're come back. We're going to focus on catchy lots Where are we going to go now? Are we going to go on a cruiser? Come on, did we catch all of the fish from here? And this is the porcupine fish is left. Oh. We want to do that one? Or? Yes. Okay. Yes. We'll try our best to catch it. Okay, we're going out to Golden Cliff, guys. We're going to show you how to catch it. So, you come over here to the Golden Cliff region, like I just warped to. You can warp by hitting the minus, and you have to get the map at the bulletin board first. Then you come over here in the corner, about as far left as you can go, and you cast out about, oh, I didn't mean to leave you off, Jack. So I'll move over some, so James can be there with me. There we go. And you cast out about 20 or so feet away. The problem is we won't be able to see the fish from here with two players. Well, we can try it. Oh, that's not what we want. I'll get it to you that. That's just not right. Well, you want to do it with one player? We so might have to so I can actually see the fish. All right, then. And let's then we'll go back to one. two players then, after that. All we'll, right. Do you want to go deep sea fishing after we catch this fish? And then we'll go together. Deal? All right. After that, we'll go to Panis Jungle next. <laughs> Okay. Hey, Dad, have you heard that um, they're making a Luigi's Mansion 4 on December? No. So, are you going... And it didn't come. It didn't. So, are you going to take your batteries out and then let... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Mm -hmm. Reconnect. And I'll be the first player? Yes. And you won't connect? Is that what you're saying? Uh huh. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Oh, I hate that, though. I'd much rather have you with me. But you need one player. So I can blow it up. I'll show you what I mean, guys. See how I can come in closer? Now I can show you how to do the porcupine fish. See, it's a, it looks a lot like a, I don't believe any of that said. That might be it swimming by, but it's not coming out right there. But it looks a lot like that fish, but it's darker and a little wider. So we're gonna let that one swim on by. It looks like that fish that just swam to the left a little bit, but not. That might be it to our left. We'll try that one. It might have been it, not pumped out. Hold on, guys. If the video is flipped over, we're sorry. It's uh, not showing yeah. that right we're now. Sorry, guys. Uh, if it's flipped. It's showing Out that it's again, sorry. Again, then we're oh, sorry. No, about that's a sorry. Then one. we're sorry about that. Yeah, we're going to try to get the videos right from now on. We messed up on the last one. Yeah, but. Last one posted. It wasn't um, the last one. Guys, posted. have you seen a girl in eighth grade named Aubrey from Florida? And um, okay. Aubrey has. White hair with the white ponytail and with blue or green eyes. And she's white. And 
What about that's her, Jan? Right. Is that your cousin? Yeah. She was his cousin by marriage. He, and she, he's just wondering about her. Yeah. So if you've seen a girl look like that named Aubrey in 8th grade in Florida, please let us know in the comments below. He'd like to say hi to her again. We kind of lost contact because her mom and D James's uncle are no longer married. So we don't get to see her no more. He just kind of misses her. Right, James? Uh-huh. If you don't see it, it probably isn't it. Uh... This one will have a tail that kind of wags back and forth, kind of like the grass puffer. That's definitely not it. That don't look like it either. We're going to let that swim by. It's, it takes patience with this one. That's not it either. The one to the left. That's a rock push right there that bit our hook. Mm -hmm. We're so not falling for that one. I've seen an eel swim by. That's a good fish, but it's not the one we want. So we'll wait until we see one that looks like it could be it. We Let's... still haven't posted our second video on Wii Sports 1, but we will, like, tomorrow. It looks like a horse mackerel right there. We're going to let that swim on by. On um, which one, James? On We Sports 1. Yeah, we haven't done the second one yet. We're still thinking about what we're going to do on the second one. I want to play baseball. James does not. Because we already played it. That's his story. He's sticking to it. See, it's kind of like that one that's swimming around right now. But that kind of looked like a grass puffer. I can't tell. Why. It's kind of a little bit bigger. It looks darker, so it could be one. We're going to try. Hopefully that's it. It's hard to distinguish them between a grass puffer. Oh, no, I got a horse mackerel. I even got the wrong one in the water. Oh, well. We're going to try one uh, again. We're going to get it. See, this one takes patience because it's hard to distinguish this fish. Unless it's puffed out. It's a puffer fish, so it can puff its cheeks out, and then it becomes easy to see. see a fish there. Normally when you don't see it, it's not it. That could be it right there to the right. I think that was it, but it could have been the other one to the left. I couldn't tell which one bit our hook. Let's see as we bring it in. You seen how the tail was moving back and forth? It looked a little bit bigger than a grass puffer. That looked like the right fish, guys. So let's see as it comes in. Oh, come on, be it. Yes, we got it. That's it, guys. New catch, por porcupine fish. I was saying the wrong fish. Not puffer fish, it's porcupine fish. That's the last fish that we haven't caught in this area. Okay. Now let's go to Panish Jungle. Okay. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll warp back into the hotel. Have we caught um, that password fish from... Panish Jungle? No, no, no. From Paycar Beach. Have we caught all the fish at Paycar Beach? I don't think so. But if you want to go to the jungle, that's an exciting place to go. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Let's go to the jungle.
We normally read the words, but right now we're trying to hurry because, you know. But it's fun to actually read the words and just relax and be polite. There's our driver. James used to call him his dad. He doesn't say that all the time. Thank you. Okay, so let's see what challenges they got on the bulletin board. Sign up for that, yeah. And plus, I think the master mode one is going to be a bit harder. We want a Dorado? Oh, we can't do a target mode. Okay, so we got to go fishing. Yes. Do y'all want to go over what it, how to catch a platinum gar? Alligator go? We could do that. Uh-huh. Okay. So what? It never I'll... takes us this long to catch a porky fine fish. Yeah, it took a little while today. But it was hard to really recognize them off that area. Because it's kind of cloudy water, guys, just like this is. This is cloudy water, too. But these, uh, these gars, you can tell the difference in the water. I'll show you how to. We'll have to switch to big bait once we get over there. Or we can do Dorados. I'll let y'all decide. I think I think we'll do the platinum alligator car. That'll be a good lesson. And we'll see if the electric eel, I think we have that out there too. Those are very hard to catch, but they're fun. They're challenging. So we gotta get out of here quickly though. It's already two o'clock in the afternoon. 1400 is 2 p.m. Military time. Never been in the military, but I'm a nurse, and we use military time, too. So we'll, we'll get out here real quick. You can't warp in this area. You actually got to go out on the boat. Oh, it was a... We don't want to do that challenge, because we want to show them how to catch a platinum elephant. Even though we like taking challenges from other fishers, fishermen, or fisher ladies, fisher people, <laughs> and uh, and challenge and you know try to win the challenge. I'm back to two player. Huh? I'm back to two. Yay! I'm glad you're joining me for the second part of this video. We might show you how to do this in this part. And then wake up in the morning and catch something we haven't caught yet. We're going to look and see what we haven't caught in this area and try to catch that tomorrow morning. So that's a good thing. And hopefully we'll be able to go to land and catch it. Okay, so now we're in the area where you're going to find the alligator guards. Right there. I see one right there. You see that one right there? That's a platinum. You see how shiny it is? That's a platinum alligator. Bar. So we gotta put on a big tackle. Because that's a big fish. Sometimes that play hard to get. Red tail catfish is going to try to steal our bait. You see it right there? Uh huh. It actually swam away, but so did our platinum. Look at it, guy. I'm going to try to come at this a different way. It's going to be hard to tell when it's the right fish in this position. 
So I'm going to go right here before the trip. It'll be a lot easier to see when it's our fish that's trying to bite the tackle. That's not it. That's the red tail catfish. And red tail catfish is worth some points. We've already caught a lot of them in this game, I believe, with this user, so we don't want to necessarily catch one right now. I want to show you how to get that platinum alligator, though. I don't see him in the picture yet. That's a little disappointing. I thought he'd be right there. He might have to motor around unless I see him in the next few. Looks like he disappeared on us. Okay, we're going to pull in because I don't see him anymore. Let's see. Oh, there's one right there. See, that's what's trying to steal our bait. He caught bass. I'm going to work with You know what? Don't look as shiny. I think that's a regular alligator guard. So it's getting darker, it's harder to tell. Some reason that one disappeared. We'll pull in this red tail gap fish and we'll try to go to a different location. Oh, we're going down. I know that's not the fish we want, but that's okay because it's worth a lot of points. One we had, we were trying to catch. What we're going to do this time is we're going to put on rainbow bait and go to a different location and find another platinum that we get. At first, it took me forever to catch a platinum alligator dog because I couldn't tell the difference. But if you can notice, in the water, you can tell the one that looks shiny is the platinum. If you can only find it in a mangrove grove pool like this. So in this area, it's a red tail catfish, and it's an ass, so that's worth quite a few points. So that's worth it. All this thousand points, too. It's only the second one we caught, huh? That's surprising. I thought it would probably be a lot more than that that we caught it now. Okay, let's put on the right tackle. Whoops, not lure. No, definitely not lure. Accidentally put lure. Okay, so we want the same uh, equipment, but different tackle. We got the right one. Okay, let's go move up. It's getting late. It's too late, so we'll try to. Y'all want to try to catch it the first thing in the morning? Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> Is he talking? Yeah, he said all right. 
Oh, oh, uh, hey, uh, hey, pardon me. Well, um, let's see how much this baby is worth. You didn't say anything. No, no. I said, oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. There's that porcupine fish. Reptile catfish. That's 4230. That's worth quite a few points. Not a bad day. All right, so. We're going to take him on into his room, see what he hasn't caught. That's important to do, especially when you're going back to a place. We have, we've we been to this place before. I don't know what we call what we didn't catch. It's important to look at your aquarium every day. Okay, so it, it had a good day. 59,085 points. Good day. Well, almost a record day for him. Okay, so let's look in the Panos jungle. See what fish he has not caught in this area yet. So he needs a cardinal tetra. That's what that one is. Hasn't gotten a royal knife fish. That's four fish were missing yep. so far. A paku, I think that is. Uh, and that's a smaller fish over there in the same area. Both of these can be caught where we were hunting for the platinum alligator guard. African pike, I think that's called. I think that's a pack. We do already have those fish. That's the alligator guard, a platinum alligator guard, a dorado, and that's a uh, paracatu. And still got to catch this one. So this one right here. It's for terapists, and they're very hard to catch. And it takes many fishing And it's a boss battle. That is a boss battle. You're correct about that. Uh, special. So we'll see if we got the electric gill or if we've even entered the password yet. That's the electric gill, I believe, right there. So no, it don't look like we have. Okay, so what we want to see is take the laptop. Give me the laptop. All right. We'll see if we need to enter the uh, password for it, and in the morning I can do that. Let's let him go to bed, and I'll look it up on the path on this. All right. We're going to go early morning fishing, guys. So we do have plenty of time. Do you need a piece of paper? No. Oh, all right. I just need to do this while he's trying to get ready to lay down. If you guys ever try to complete this game on I'm Sitting, please um, look up all our cousins and see if they can look up all our codes and pay attention real good to the codes. If I had paper and some of the stuff I brought, just help yourself and pay it. And, and little yeah. grandma's back at our YouTube channel, too. Yes, she is. Welcome back to And guys, bit. if you ever try to get all the code fish, please pay attention to our clothes. Okay, real, so now. To our codes really good. We're going to go look at the computer. Otherwise, you will have to look at them again and again and again. I'm going to enter the password for the electric eel, which is TYP. Yeah. That's right, eel. T Y P R Q. Let's make sure. Yep, I know. T Y B three. Okay, so we just got added. So no, we had not released that yet. So I'm glad we did that. So now we'll get out of that. And let's go on out here and, and we'll try to catch that one and, electric, and the uh, platinum alligator guard. Okay, so let's see if we can get a bonus for doing it here. Pariah, we don't need one of those. Electric kill, y'all want to take that one? 
Yes, let's catch the eel. Yeah, well, that's pretty exciting. And sign up for that activity. Let's go. Okay, we walk down here to the boat dock. Of course, you gotta rent the floatable. And that's what we're trying to do now is go around to each location and catch all the fish we haven't caught so far. We got all the ones in Team in Paradise Beach. Because it's so dark, I'm going to put this up in the top corner and kind of help us guide us so we don't miss the uh, turns. See, the map will help you. Especially while you're in this uh, shadowy area, there's a lot of trees, a lot of coves, a lot of caves in this area. Once you get out of this area, it's a lot easier to navigate. But when you're early morning fishing or late night fishing in this area, it's kind of hard to see. There's no light by these boats, these floatables. So. It's almost like being in the uh, cave. I don't know if y'all watched the Safe Air Cave video, but it's kind of like that. It's kind of hard to see. So we're going to come back over here to the mangrove pool, which is up in the top portion of this map. That's where you catch the electric eel, the platinum alligator gar, and those two small fish that I showed you, the African pike and the royal knife fish. Oh, I think that one is actually the black ghost knife fish. Something like that. Haven't looked at the name in a while. So, those, those are the areas to catch them. I think we can catch a paku over here, too. It's another fish we haven't caught yet. See, so in this area where it's shadowy, once again, the map comes in handy, as we see. It's early, so we can't really see very well. Okay, now we got a little more light. Okay, that's a platinum right there. Oh, yeah. You can see how shiny it is. See this woman right there? It's definitely in platinum. We're not going to take catch this rat. Go ahead and tell catfish. Got one of them yesterday. That's a smaller one. See now the platinum kind of disappeared. Let's try to wait. There it popped back up. So we can get it interested again. I'm not sure what that is biting my hook, but it's not the platinum alligator guard, it's not an electric gear. Dorado's going to try to steal our bait. It's a pretty fish, but we don't need it right now. Now keep your eyes alert, because as you see, that red-tailed catfish tried to come in and steal that bait again. Another one to the right, Dorado. There's a peacock bass. Got it on the 
hook. Now we gotta fight with it to get it in. These are hard to get in. This is the best tackle in the game, so it's a little bit easier, but not much. You rather keep it in yellow orange area? starting to come in now. I'd rather keep them in the green and the yellow here. You don't want to get too far in the red, you have a danger of losing. Keep your lead remote turned the right direction so there's not an extra tension on the line. Yes, we are, because that's our challenge fish. Mm -hmm. We took a challenge to catch you. Does that give you extra points? It, it does. That's double points for that electric fish. Let's see we can find that platinum alligator dog again. He can disappear on us. Looks like he disappeared. We got another electric eel we can go after. I did get to hang out with David that much. I know, he's busy working right now, huh? I never get to hang out with him much anymore. You'll get to. Yeah, if he quits our job, then we... You don't want him to quit no job. We want him to work his job. I'm going to draw you to get fired, so that way you... No, you're can, not. So that way I can spend more time with them. I need some backup. I'm back in Back up. Back up. Back I guarantee you, if I hooked it up right there, it would have been the other fish. Mm -hmm. 
Is that the fish we're after right there? It would have been good if we could have gotten it. Nope, it didn't bite a hook. But it, yeah, that's the challenge fish we're today. We're trying to also get a platinum alligator bar. That's what I told the people I was trying to catch originally. We got an electric gill for them to see all right. Even though it was just a D. It wasn't a bad fish. It's not the biggest fish. No, I don't want it. was looking out. I need to call Amari for backup. Oh, yeah? Hey, Amari. Well, we you know you like flack and uh, law cop. Act like you don't know what that means. Yeah, hold on. Hey, Amari, I need some backup. Uh, we accidentally got a red tail catfish. I didn't think it was fighting hard enough for an alligator, Gar. Okay, well, let's look around and try to find an old. Since that one didn't bite a hook. Oh, man, he did answer. I'm already sleeping. I'm already dead answer. Why you gotta be sleeping? Because he didn't answer. He's probably just sleeping or playing some Madden. Is that his favorite game? Yeah, I would kind of like us to play that. Like that one to the left is a platinum. I'm not falling for it again, red tail catfish. Oh, really? Or oh, peacock bass. I see you right there. You mm. see that one still? Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, that's a peacock bass coming. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Sorry, kid, but I don't lose.